Computer science videos here today to show you guys in the tutorial how to add end screen elements to a YouTube video on a Mac computer. Without further ado, let us start the video. So in this tutorial, you need to have access to a Mac computer, an account for YouTube and a project that we have been working on within Photoshop to create the end screen element itself. So we can now turn the attention to the Mac computer. Let's open up Photoshop and export the photo that will be in the video, for the video, for the end screen element towards the end of the video. So, computer science videos end screen.psd. Let's just click on this, open that up. And so the image itself is ready for exporting. Let's just, we can share and add to photos or we can just go to file, export as. And scale the resolution by 200%. As you can see on screen, let's just export to the desktop. Change this to end screen. Click on save. Let this now export to the desktop. It will take some time. Command S to save, minimize Photoshop for the moment. Open up the end screen image. That's okay, that's done. Quick preview. Let's now turn the attention to ScreenFlow. We have been working on a video. This is a trial.screenflow. Let's just open that up. And as you can see on screen, I have a previous photo added to the project. Let's just delete as we no longer require this. Take the current exported image and add this to the screen flow project. Be very careful when it comes to readjusting the size of the image itself. And here's something else to note, the video that we export needs to be longer than 25 seconds otherwise the end screens simply will not work and so we are ready to export command s to save file export we can save this as video export to the desktop And so once that has now exported, let's close out of screen flow as we have the video exported to the desktop. And so now we can go all the way down to the dock, go to the web browser, which is Safari in this case, go to YouTube Studio, make sure you are signed into the account. And as you can see on screen, I have two private videos as I have been working on the end screen test. Just a bit of trial and error to see what may need to be done if we ever receive any errors or the end screens may to be readjusted that helps a lot so we can now upload the video create upload videos take the video drag and drop to the upload and let's now wait for this to upload And whilst we are waiting, we can fill in the title, description, thumbnail if we require. But just for the purpose of this tutorial, let's just click on next. Monetize, no, done. Next, next, next. 
let's just put the video on unlisted for the moment click on save the video itself has been uploaded to my channel as unlisted they are now processing the HD version let's just click on the video itself we can now click on the end screens and now we can navigate to the bottom of the screen and click on add element or we can add element for the left top corner of the screen let's just click on a video most recent or we can choose a specific video let's just choose the last video which is the most recent and this needs to be moved to the top right corner of the screen click on element let's just click on a playlist all videos move this to the bottom right corner of the screen as you can see everything is in line with each other and we also need a subscribe button so we can get people to subscribe to the channel which will help the channel to grow let's just click on save and so that itself is all done let us now right click and reload the page click on the video itself we can now watch the video within our channel and if we do not see the end screens that's because the video itself is unlisted let's just put this video on public for one moment just to check so we can go back view on YouTube for the moment let's now navigate towards the end of the video and there we have the end screens at the end of the video for this tutorial it was only about 10 seconds but we can not have them for 20 seconds which is what I would do. Let's just click on the video. And there you go. Subscribe. My next video and all the videos from the Computer Science Videos playlist. Added to my video and will be added to all the next videos that I produce and upload to my channel. So, we can now quit this video, privatize the current video. from public to private save quit safari and so that's it for this video I'll see you guys in the next tutorial thanks for now